hey guys welcome back to our channel so i'm making this intro while on my way home from work because when i get home i want to start editing this video so this is actually the part two to our previous video i did shopping for my kitchen uh, kitchenware on a saturday and then i went shopping for groceries and foodstuffs the next day which was on a sunday so that day i created a shopping list because I'm so easy to get distracted. I'll end up, I, most of the time, if I don't go with a shopping list, I end up buying things that are not necessary and I leave things that are necessary. So since I moved into this new house in December last year, I never cooked or did nothing because I, like, I was trying to settle down. So when I did this shopping, I was doing a bulk shopping because there was nothing in the house. My fridge was empty. All my cabinets were empty. So now this was like, a huge shopping I don't want to talk much because this video is kind of long uh, so let's get straight into this video and enjoy Feel uninvited. Left home in West LA. I'm not excited so uninspired on my way to play the bay while you're alone this girl's a wonder she loves me as yeah, she needs Let me show you how long the, this receipt is. Like, it's so long. I've done a lot of shopping. I didn't have anything in the house, actually. So, all these things, <laughs> it's a lot. They have costed 8991 That's like uh, 9000 Things are expensive, you guys. Like, everything is just so expensive. The prices increased. So, guys, I'm back to the house. I've spent, like, two hours in the supermarket, and that's because I was very keen on prices. So, <laughs> I'm, I'm telling you, guys, prices have increased. I wonder how people with families really survive because everything is just so expensive. How are you guys surviving? What? Anyway, let me show you what I have gotten. So, I will start with... Um, with the sanitary st uh, stuff this is just uh washing powder this is for cleaning dishes this is it is a bleach <laughs> i also bought a tila <laughs> by the way i bought i don't usually use this but i bought it because it ha it is my husband's name maybe he's the owner of this brand and he doesn't want to tell me he's testing me and then i bought this um what do we call fabric conditioner bathing soaps cleaning cleaning powder this is for mosquitoes just in case you know i really hate mosquitoes so i usually have this in the house and the toothpaste this is for cleaning my cooking pots cleaning utensils toilet freshener yeah these are the drinks that I bought for myself. So these are fruit juices. I brought the small one. Like when you buy the big ones, you have to like drink it in three days. So I don't like that kind of pressure. So when I open this, I just finish it. And this one can wait for as long as until next time when I want to drink it again. And then some yogurt. Those four. And then this, I really like it because it is, it, is, it is ginger, lemon and honey. Dawa means medicine, so it's very good for my health and stomach and very uh, high in vitamin C. And then this vitamin C, I bought two of them. So all this will go into the fridge. Yeah, for this category, I bought um, 
cooking oil this is soy sauce this is choma sauce i've never tasted this i just bought it out of curiosity i want to try it and then this is pasta sauce it's for garlic and then this is tomato ketchup tomato paste so i like to buy this in sachets i don't like to buy the canned one because when you open it it's a mess and you have to use it as soon as possible before it goes bad so i like this because i just use all of it at once and i'm done with it yeah so i bought four of them and then i bought these are reco cubes chicken flavor and then this is beef flavor yeah next category is cereals this is rice this is my favorite rice like this is what this brand this type of rice is what made me love the love to eat rice like i can't buy from any other brand just this brand uh this is what is it green grams and then this is ugali flour and then this is just spaghetti and this is uh, for popcorns when i'm bored in the house then this category i will call it freezer category because most of the things are for the freezer so this is just bacon i bought two because they were on offer and i love bacon uh these are uh, beef sausages i love beef sausages these are 10 eggs and then i saw this and i love them and uh, these are chicken nuggets chicken pop and chicken fingers so these are for frying when I, if i this is my first time actually trying this and if i will like them i'll go back for more and then this is um grapes seedless grapes and then i bought oranges i also bought uh, watermelon it was very affordable 93 shillings also for storing things in the freezer these are just wrappers storage bags next category is snacks i don't know if these snacks will make it up to the end of the week because me and snacks both of us can't stay in the same house one of us has to leave and it's not me it is the snacks so i love chips so much so that's why i bought these potato chips or crips depending on where you are from and then I bought this small one because I love Pringles. I, next time when I go shopping, I'll buy the bigger one. And then I bought this cake. This is like a reward for going shopping and for motivating myself to be cooking from now onwards. <laughs> yeah, so that's it. When I tell you guys I had nothing, you know, my fridge was off. So now I'm going to fill it up. So guys what i'm doing here i'm just unwrapping and crushing the record cubes and putting them into the spice jar i usually like to do this because it makes my work really easy when i'm cooking so anytime i'm cooking i just scoop out the record cubes and put in my food and that's it tonight i'm going to call it a night because it's already 10 p.m and tomorrow is monday i need to go to work so i will leave everything as it is right now and finish tomorrow when i come back from work so tomorrow i'll pass by the market because it's on my way home i'll pass by the market and buy peas and fruits also what else yeah i will boil the cereals tomorrow and put them in the fridge meat um, i don't like to freeze meat i don't like to store meat in the freezer because i feel like freezing for too long affects the taste and then the fact that i can just walk two minutes here and get the butcher a lot of butcheries um there's no point of storing meat in the house in the fridge i can just buy on my way home 
and then like like that you get fresh meat all the time so i'm not going to buy any meat if i have to store meat in the fridge it's the leftovers yeah so i'm not cooking it's late so i'm making these chicken nuggets these ones that i bought i'm too curious i can't sleep without tasting them so i will just have that and the cake and that's it going to buy 10 more of this 10 more packets mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. they remind me of Burger King nuggets mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. the next day hey guys so this is the next day this is shopping day number two so today was grocery day. I'll show you what I have bought and then we close this video for today. Yeah. So this is a collard. It's for my dinner today. Uh -huh. Let me just put them down. So you guys remember yesterday I loved, loved the chicken nuggets. So I couldn't resist. So the chicken nuggets were so I went back to the supermarket and I bought plenty because the one yesterday i had bought for sampling so there they are but this they are delicious delicious yeah so these ones they will go into the freezers i bought peas so i will boil them tonight and put them in the freezer tomatoes this as well yeah there is more cucumbers so for tonight that's it i will wash these uh, groceries put them in the fridge and then i will also or well, i will also boil the peas and soak the green grams green grams i will boil them tomorrow so that i put them in the freezer also so for today i'll just boil this i always wash my fruits and vegetables with soap because they have gone through so many hands and so many chemicals so i usually feel safer washing them with soap but if i lay down and i play dead and i stay dead maybe you'll get sick of being a monster out of my head under my bed think you're something out of my nightmares sitting right there but if i lay down Still it hard to view it like a dawn Never really know just what you want With you I don't ever feel cold So my vegetables are now ready to go to the fridge These ones I've wrapped them into in cling film Because I want them to stay fresh for longer periods of time I, Next task, as the peas are boiling I'm going to soak these green grams A bit of it yeah, I'll soak them and boil them tomorrow evening. So I like to soak them for several hours so that they don't give me acidity. Oh, I will show you how the fridge looks like. So this is the freezer compartment. So this is the bacon I bought. Uh, these are the sausages. They're already frozen. So it's sausages in there. Those are my nuggets. All my nugget packets here and then this is leftover food that i stored here for another time and i had to put the the green green peas inside here and then i arranged them into this container because uh for stability and then this they have a this paper they have a, it has a tendency of sticking to the sides of the fridge when freezing so when frozen so that's why they are inside here so it is the the green beans and also oh, hold on and as you can see there the green grams 
Yeah, these are the green grams that I boiled. Yeah, so I put them, I usually uh, portion them like this so that when I want to like make a stew, I just take this, make all of it and that's it. But if it's in one big container, you have to defrost the whole thing and it's unhealthy. Yeah, and then it's too much work. So I just separate them like this. So this is for one or two meals and uh, I'm done with that. And then these are reusable. I wash them and boil again and put the cereals in there. So for now, that is how it looks like. Not so much stuff. These are the drinks that I bought. Yogurt, vitamin C drink and this dawa. And then I have cucumber on this compartment mangoes and also grapes and this watermelon and here this is um beetroot for juice also and those green peppers and also here i have tomatoes i bought this for making juice passion fruit and oranges and then on the door side here there's nothing so eggs i just put this uh canned beans here for decoration <laughs> they're canned beans so I, I just put them there for no reason at all and also this this is the pasta sauce that i bought and then more juice and then tomato paste there and uh, coconut coconut cream that's how it looks like as of now I'll add more stuff as we go by yeah I'm proud of myself it's so rare that you find me uh, restocking my fridge most of the time it's off even my baby is so happy like he's always telling me why do you have the fridge and you're not like using it so yeah there it is I hope you like it guys <laughs> but it's a small fridge for one person yeah, it's enough for me <laughs>